morning. So this is Miss Marina. I have some exciting news about Harry Potter. So I was really bummed when we weren't able to finish our book. So optional if you haven't finished the book because I know I also sent out earlier in weeks prior that you could um if you have the book to just continue reading it and enjoy the reading but if you haven't let me show you something pretty neat okay and even if you don't want to read the book but you want to play around with this website you can so I wanted to show you how to navigate the website so you want to go to wizardingworld.com okay now as soon as I put it I'm already I've been on it, so it's going to be this, wizardingworld.com. But you can also put in Harry Potter, okay? And that, when you put in Harry Potter, the first website should be wizardingworld.com. So you want to click on this website. Now, <clears throat> this website can only be accessed if you have your parents' permission, Okay, so this is something you can do with your parents, you can do with the sibling, but the reason you need your parents' permission is because there is a login and there is a register where you can register to do more things on this website. When you do register, it's going to ask you for an email. Now, you shouldn't have an email, and you cannot use your school email on this because it will not work. So you will need to use one of your either mom's email or dad's email or an adult's email to be able to log in. I already have an account. Surprise, surprise. So as soon as I hit login, it logs me in. Okay. Um, and it, this is how it would look. So if right here, this is where you would say create an account. Um, and then it's going to ask you for an email address and then you create your password. And then it tells you to continue. <clears throat> so once you're in, and this is taking a bit too long. <laughs> Once you're in, um, like I said, I've already been on this website for many years. So I know exactly what's on it. And it's so cool. So here you can go and see what your house is. As you can tell, I'm Gryffindor. But you can also go to this one. And this one tells you your favorite. So my favorite character was Hermione. My um, favorite spell, you, I expect, on, um, expect a Patronum. That's my favorite spell. Um, and it just tells you all the, the... Oops. Sorry. Tells you all what you like, your places that you like to go within Harry Potter. So this is just fun stuff. It also gives you the type of wand. This is my wand. Um, it's made with unicorn hair look at that Ooh, so excited my wand is so pretty um and then my patronus is a dun mare so that's my patronum patronus sorry um so you can do that okay but here's the cool part if you go over here where it says home okay and it'll kind of prop you up to a new little window and this should be introducing Harry Potter at home, okay? You can hear it hit, hit this, but we'll come back to this. I want to show you where you can go and find um, the book. So if you go to news, go to news, and then you're going to get this um, whole bunch of information, things you can do. You can come back to that later, okay? And obviously, we're going to go into introducing Harry Potter at home. You want to pick the one that says at home. So once you click that, it's going to bring you up to a nice little letter here, blah, 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 blah. But something good, and you can read it. It tells you what, what J.K. Rowling did during this time. So what she was able to do was put the first book here in audible stories audible.com okay so when you click this link it takes you to this okay and you hit the start listening and then you obviously you would hit harry potter but since i've been playing around with it it's already here 
and they have Harry Potter in different languages. You may read it in Spanish or you can read it in English and they just have it in I believe seven different languages here. Okay. So once you go into this, we left off on chapter three. Okay, so you can start from the beginning or you can pick the chapter we were on. We were about to start chapter three. So once you hit that. Chapter three, the letters from no one. The escape of the Brazilian boa constrictor earned Harry his longest ever punishment. By the time he was allowed out of his cupboard again, the sum. So, you can continue. Now, the, the only bad thing I would say on my part is it, it's an audible. So, you're listening to it. So, this is a lot of listening comprehension. But, if you do have a copy of the book, you can have the audio on and be listening to this at the same time. Okay? Another cool thing about this is this um, website doesn't only have Harry Potter, it has a whole bunch of stories. You can pretty much listen for free right now. After this whole quarantine thing happens, all these you have to pay for. But this is a great source of just listening to stories, okay? Because remember, these are all audiobooks. That means you only are able to listen to them. So um, that's pretty cool, right? So now let's go back to the Harry Potter. So that's the main thing I wanted to show you on that. But then once you're here, um, back in the wizarding world, you can go back to all these different places and play around with it, okay? Or I just go back to my at home. That's the one you wanna hit, the, the Harry Potter at home. And like I said, it's usually going to be the main page. So you can go through here. So when you hit that, bringing Hogwarts to you. And it tells you what you can be doing during this time. You can have to cast a spell over everyday games. Um, here you have many things you can do, such as make your own scrapbook of Harry Potter. Find 20 fantastic facts about Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. Um, learn some friendship lessons. I mean, there is a plethora of things you may do here. It's Harry Potter, Who's Harry, Harry, Ron, and Hermione, introducing. That's something we're on. And then this is where if you want to know your house, again, you would have to register with the parent email. But there's so you can after you read the book you can take the quiz and see if you if you are able to answer the questions I got a hundred percent thank you very much and there's a word search you may use there is just so much fun stuff you guys can be playing around here with okay and it's all Harry Potter um, so I hope this helps I hope this is at least a little bit of like I said, I was really bummed when we couldn't do Harry Potter, but I don't want you to not be able to read it. So if you did start getting interested or you are trying to continue to read it, but you don't have a copy, this is a way you can do it. So maybe you can listen for a good 20 minutes, take a break or listen to a chapter. So you decide what you want to do here. But the main thing, remember, you need parents permission because you have to log in. You have to register with them. Okay, so again, let's see Miss Marino's home page. Once you register, you're able to create this home page. Okay, so to, it'll when you pick your house, it'll ask you a whole bunch of questions in order for them to place you in your house. Um, like I said, I got Gryffindor, duh, your favorites, my wand, and then my Patronus. Okay, so if I'm gonna. Um, if you do decide to do that, let me know and then maybe we can even create a little book club. So I will put this in the HPDL under Google Classroom. Okay, I hope you enjoy.